A METRO SQUAD OF NEARLY A DOZEN TEAMS HAS FINISHED ITS FIRST FULL DAY OF INVESTIGATIONS AFTER A BODY WAS FOUND IN A CEMETERY. LISA BENSON JOINS US FROM CASS COUNTY WHERE, LISA, THE BODY WAS FOUND. THAT IS RIGHT. INVESTIGATORS SPENT THE ENTIRE DAY TALKING TO FAMILY AND FRIENDS AND SEARCHING CELL PHONES AND SOCIAL MEDIA SITES TRYING TO FIGURE OUT WHAT HAPPENED INSIDE OF THIS CEMETERY. IT'S GOING TO BECOME A MEMORIAL PLAZA. And we're going to uh, have a monument uh, made for the veterans. Larry Dobson is the board president of the Will Cemetery. It's been in rural Cass County since 1868. I would say the most of our residents are certainly from Cass County, and many of them, of course, from the Peculiar and Raymore area. Dobson is well aware of the 14 people buried here this year, but the body found in his cemetery on Wednesday afternoon leaves him baffled. It's just very, very unfortunate for. The person in person, persons involved, and for the cemetery itself. A 10 team Metro squad is investigating the homicide. He was shot. Uh, we've ruled out any suicide or anything like that. So uh, right now we're just looking for who may have possibly had a motive. The victim has been identified as 25 year old Forrest Fuller. Investigators believe Fuller was shot in the cemetery, which makes the search for witnesses more difficult. Well, being a rural area, it's harder to find maybe somebody who just happened to be standing outside and hear something or see something. But at the same time, being a smaller community, people know a lot of people, and people are familiar with uh, who lives around them, who travels up and down the road. Now, Dobson and his board members are hoping for a quick arrest so family members feel comfortable as they come out this weekend to pick up their Memorial Day flowers. Reporting live in Cass County, Lisa Benson, 41 Action News.